I told you I was supposed to have cut down on my commentary before I have nothing to be talking about seriously if I am joined by this lady I have been wanting to talk to all my life as a presenter on TV today Max one of the happiest days in my life because you just can't tell seriously sometimes Obi will be beating somebody that you can't see and you begin to wonder what does she see in that person this is what I see in Akuma Mama Zimbi Meda Rashid Medasse, Meda, 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 Medasse. <laughs> you know, it, it goes with the sign. Okay. Medasse. Tell me, mm. what is it? What is what? What is Medasse? Thank you, obviously. Of course. But where it sounds that amorous, Meda, as if you're in cloud 90 or you're in heaven. What, what, what? You see, what, 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 what? <laughs> Rash, yes, we need to show appreciation because our maker even needs the appreciation. All right. Otherwise, you wouldn't have asked and clone away. They do never me fear. So certainly, uh, but we 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 don't love saying appreciate it by saying me that say. Okay. So in a nice way, in a romantic way, I said me da. Meda, 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 say it's like give me the opportunity. Forgive me for over laughing. All right, Akuma. Yes. If you went to work mm -hmm. and your boss did something mm. extraordinary, yes. How do you say Meda say to him? Just in case you would have to speak three. They know who I am. Okay. Certainly, I'll get close to you and do touch you <laughs> and say don't one. Medasse, my C O O, and I, I touch them, I hug them, oh, and I'll oh, say oh, Eche, Kwam. The first time I said Medasse uh, to my C O O, mm -hmm. Eche Kwam, he said, "That's your Medasse." No, he didn't get it. <laughs> but later he, he saw that no, it's part and parcel mm -hmm. of, of my star, the girl. So mm -hmm, the they girl. get used to it. I know. Mm. So seriously, how do people relate to you when you step out there? See, you have, you have so many people who love you just because of your style. Yeah. Even if you find yourself on a platform. I remember you had to do some MC somewhere. You yeah. did the Midasse from behind it. Is it true? Yeah, it's true. I remember uh, Imagine Advertising where they did Honor Lumba and I was right. there. Sure, sure, sure. Yeah, you remember there. that show? Yeah, I wasn't there, but I really enjoyed it. Yeah, I, so I we, we planned that let me stay behind and say Midasse to the wonderful people who were there to wear the concert. And they loved it, you know. So, Apparently, people call me Midasse. <laughs> when they see me, they say, Midasse, I say, yes, Midasse. 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 You know, what it goes with the sign. You're my... so fresh. Mm. You are looking extra young. You just simply remind me of Akosia Japon, one of my. Why did you mention videos. her? You people mention say we're well. twins. You, you look alike. You look alike. And you're <laughs> so, so beautiful. Ooh. What do you do, special? You drink um. Water. First of all, I think my maker created me this way. Right. And um, I think eating, what do you need to do? What do you What's have to do? What's your favorite food? My favorite food? Hey, I'm pesi Medase. Medase. You know, then you have the kwewun suswa, you need kobe somewhere, and mane awo, you know, like mm. soup. And I love taking fruits a lot. Oh my God. Yes. Medase. I always have it with me. Medase. Patronize made in Ghana goods. Are you always an African prince? Most of the time. Really? Even if I should wear something as just some beads, as some, you know, something around me to make me more African. Right. Today we're here to be talking about the foundation that has been set up by Akuma Mama Zimbi. Beyond what we see on TV, there's just a lot more up her sleeves, which goes a long way to save society, to serve society, to help society, and bring out the real potential in these women. Some people would usually render useless in some cultures when a woman's husband dies she is probed she's interrogated she's given a shave she's given a brand she's given a tack mm. and fingers point at her medasi don't say. cry yet I, I will not cry the crying over is past right now i was here in idaho now you will say and then we move forward what what touched you to actually start something on widowhood um you know, as you're presenting on ETV, sure. I do on TV, I do on radio. Mm -hmm. And then you would know that apart from God, their second God is somebody they see, those they hear. Oh. So after every show on Adam FM, I see a lot of people. And then out of 20 that come to me, I have 12 that are women 
they are crying. My husband is dead, and I'm, a, I'm, I'm the one who killed her. We're supposed to evict our home. We, my children are not supposed to continue the education. The morning, we, yes, yes, today. It's happening at places that we don't know. We haven't eaten. We need money. So after doing all that, I said, ah, what is this? Is it just this view, women? Mm -hmm. Why don't I use our medium mm -hmm. to tell all widows, wherever you are, gather up this my number, call me, and they will come with our team to empower you, tell you things that you can do. Mm -hmm. Because when your husband dies, it's not the end of the road. Sure. You know, majority of women don't work. They look upon their husbands. Mm -hmm. So now that the man is gone, mm -hmm. Family say you killed him. Mm -hmm. So this home, you not stay. Wow. Move. You know, they force them to do certain things. And you and I you know the kind of widow rights they go through, mm -hmm. which is awful. Yeah. Why is it that when a, a woman dies? The man is not accused. Yes. But the moment your husband dies, you kill the person. Why? Why should it be that? It shouldn't be. Wow. So um, Mama, window, um, Mama Zimbi Foundation started. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Uh, what do you do for them actually? Do you give them food to eat? Do you put them through some income generating activities or you just put a smile on their faces by saying Meda? <laughs> Meda First of all, I bring happiness into their lives. Right. By letting you know that hey, being a widow is not a curse. Mm -hmm. It's ordained by God. Because it in it is said in the Bible, Senya me sumpa so behwe e wisia any ukraini ba. So to fulfill the scriptures, it, 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 your husband needs to die before you become a widow. Mm -hmm. You understand? Yeah. But we have made it to become a curse, the way we treat them. So Mama Zimi Foundation, what we do is when they gather, we, we, we give them happiness and say, hey, relax. You, are, you, are, you, you, are, you want to, um, I mean, be part of these widows. Don't you know they are Balak people? But from the beginning, it has been my money, my husband's friends and families who saw the bigger dream and said, hey, my mother is a woman. All that can look after her. My mother was once a single woman, you know, so people are here, but we don't have any donors, no government support, no nothing, but we're praying that um, at least we have widows day. Last year, UN gave us that opportunity. Wow. Yes, so mm. it, it is celebrated all over the world. Right. 23rd of June is Widow's Day. Mm -hmm. And that's why we're having that big conference right, at the Trade Fair Center. Have. Tell me Fabinati. what exactly is going to be happening. Is that going to be open for only widows? Oh, yes. Only widows. We are day. So we, we need to celebrate them. But all women are allowed to come in and oh, yes. support, right? Yes, if you are invited. Yes, yeah, sure. Mm -hmm. Okay, strictly by invitation. Yes. Tell me what activities are you going to be having the um, Mama Zimbi Foundation, Foundation. Yeah, on we, the Widowhood Day? <laughs> <laughs> on that day, um, some of the widow groups will be going through cookie competition. Right. And then there will be dancing competition. We'll have widows who have been... Um, we have widows... <laughs> We have women who have been widows for 23 years who um, share their experience, what they've been through, and where they are today to give them all the encouragement. And then some will also display the project in which they are. And, you know, it's, it, it, it's inviting. On the screens now, you can see it, it's a party for them. Oh it's my when God, we it's all such come. a big, big, big thing. Yeah. How many times have you done it? This is the fourth time you're doing the conference right mama zimbi i see your name up there <laughs> what, what are some of the really horrific stories these widows have shared with you you want to hear this in instances seriously i think the rest of our viewers would like oh to my god this. so it's going to be on uh saturday to the yeah this is very saturday coming 23rd right, mm -hmm. right okay um oh my god some are supposed to sleep with the cops <laughs> some are supposed to bath with the water that they use in dressing the cops what for just to prove their innocence i don't know that is some rituals they need to go in it. you and i don't know some are supposed to carry a very big pot with fire in it walk to the river you know they, 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 I, I don't even want to mention them some are kept in a room you're not supposed to be with any other person. I mean, I mean, it, it, it's horrible. Why should it be that? I mean, for sleeping with the cops who are supposed to have been your husband, that works. Many women would oh, be able to oh, endure oh, oh, that. Oh, but it's not easy. But, you see, the moment the case, you die, that, that spirit is not there. You yeah. see, we, they were just supposed to be encouraged. But they are victimized that you did this. Are you married? 
Yeah, very, very much. Great. God forbid, so many times, that one morning, you wake up with a laji. Hey, Meda. And, and, then, and then you know he's not waking up. Meda. And then they come telling you, you killed him. And they start more treating you. Don't wear your shoes, don't do anything. They crop your hair, no earrings, no makeup. You're not supposed to be with any other person. Your children are supposed to be confined in one room. What is this? Oh. So we make it become a curse. So, so you fold up, you don't want to come out. But I'm thanking God that for all the, we, we've been around for years, but since we came out, it's been six years, and it's a, a fourth conference we're going to do. Those who understood and came to the Alliance, it's Widows Alliance, network oh. and we have in our conferences so we have videos all over if it's not easy now they are happy they don't go to office to ask for money again because they are working oh. i mean they have your freedom those who want to marry are marrying yeah. you know if you don't want to fine I mean, it, it's just so disheartening in the cases where you say well i won't sleep with him in the same room mm. but what happens instantly you are pronounced guilty mm -hmm. Well, beyond just putting these smiles, are you are you able to rescue them from these rights? You know. Oh yes, we have, we have, because we we take them to those. So the um, social welfare is there. You know, the lawyers are also helping, so they enjoy their properties now. So I always told them, um, they sh they should grab this opportunity as they begin visiting a day. You know, we have Women's Day, we have Mother's Day, mm -hmm. and now we have Widow's Day. You understand. So they should come out from their shells and say, hey, this is our day. We are being celebrated. So I'm not going to, you know, I'm not going to be shy again. You have your right to marry if you want to, anywhere you want to go. I mean, families will stop maltreating you but not because now you have a say. Hmm. You understand. Mm -hmm. Have so, you met a young widow before? Very oh, young. Oh, Probably my oh. age. What's your age? I won't tell you. Yes, 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 yes. <laughs> <laughs> I have a young widow who is 20 years. Oh 20 my years. Gosh, she's not my age, obviously. Okay, I'm good. <laughs> she's, 20, she's 20 years. Mm -hmm. And now she's, she's going to school. She's working. We're looking after the kids. At 20, the husband died? No, she, the, she was um, 16 when the husband died. Wow. You know, this, this uh, kind of it, thing. It means, uh, what you, you know what? She even get married in the first place. Okay, what it is is she got pregnant and the parents forced her to get into the, the thing. And at 18, the man died. And then, wow. you know, obviously become a widow, young widow. So you can imagine people say, hey, at this girl, look at the age. Her husband died, though. Then the victimization starts. I know. <laughs> you know? And she can't say meda. She can't say that. Meda. But now a lot of them will say, hey, meda, just not to me, but God and everybody. <laughs> <laughs> All right. We're supposed to be talking about widowhood. Here we are laughing, but I mean, life goes on. Sure. Sure. Especially with the Mama Zimbi Foundation, which is putting a big, broad smile on the faces mm. of so many widows who might be watching this morning. You might want to get in touch with her towards the 23rd. So, for all of these widows who are supposed to be part of the celebration, not of the death of their husband, mm -hmm. the celebration of the lives of their husbands. Of course. Um, uh, how are they chosen? How are they, are they supposed chosen? to come and tell you, Mama Zimbi? He's no, I can't be all over. Right. That is why ETV is here. That's why Dom FM is there. That's why we have multi TV and everything. We do the announcement, they group, and then I give my number out. And then mm -hmm. you have some of them, their children send me emails. Mama so Zimbi Foundation. Are you going to be celebrating this um, hey, season? Hey, last two years we have close to 3,000 widows coming together. Today, I'm, I know this coming Saturday is going to be more. Wow. I can tell you, we have Three. the largest video conference wow. in Africa, if not worldwide, you know. Wow, you're yeah. doing a wonderful job. What is this? Flyers of that? Oh, no, the conference, the program lineup is here. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> All right. So, 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 who is supporting you now as we speak? Or who has supported you in the past? Mm. Wow. In the past, I don't want to go into it. Right. But for now, we have... Um, Imagine advertising. There are, so many. there are so many. We have Imagine Advertising. We have Nestle Ghana Limited. Mm -hmm. We have DDP. We have uh, Sedu Royal Waste Management. We have Broom Cakes and More. That woman is a widow. And if she, you need to come out. I've invited you to tell you what she went through before today. She's able to have her own catering, Broom and Cakes. Oh, baby. 
it's, it's, it's not it's not easy we have um our media partners you are one because you brought me interview mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. multimedia group we have media fan bang we have daily guide we have news one Meda. 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 pardon me if i'm not able Let to me mention all of you because something. when you step out how do people relate to you do they uh, you said they call you Meda, but is it that bubbly around you because many Ghanaian celebrities have said when they step out people don't mind them Oh. oh, you feel more than you feel more. You feel more. They call me a kuma, they call me dancy or dahuma. So, what I do, mm -hmm. and when they see me, they want to tell me their problems immediately. So, your and show they is know, at night, right? It's yeah, at night. night. Oh, it's 10 on, on radio, it's 10 p.m. That's not fair to, to uh, 10 to 10 p.m. to 12 midnight, and on TV, on TV, it's 11 to 1 a.m. He says it's not fair to daddy. Yeah, but now he's listening. He'll be very happy with me for saying this. He's happy because yeah. he started giving me the encouragement. All right. He knows me and I know him. Wow. So the night so is most okay. Of, the night is okay. Most mm. of the things I do when I started. Does he was watch? We, Oh, he does. So what does he say? What's the feedback? He said, no, no, this one was too much. But this one, you were okay. <laughs> He's to tell me sometimes you become so emotional. Yeah, You I know? know. So know. let me tell you the secret. I started my radio and TV programs in my own life, in my relationship and in my marriage. Oh, okay. You know, it has to be a true story. Mm -hmm. So the person watching or the person listening will have the confidence to come to you. Mm. So whatever we do on our network at Dom is real life stories. Mm -hmm. On TV is the but same. But must it be about the presenters? Because, so, I mean, as much as possible, aren't you supposed to remain neutral or give a diversionary tactic? <laughs> no, what, 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 no, no. What it says is my, my program is relationship and marriage oh, program. Okay. okay. So you, you understand? Just have to. So I have to use it, but I don't say it's uh, me. Oh, I okay, put so names there. I'm only telling so you, you today. Meda. Meda. Next time I'm using Rashida. <laughs> Meda. <laughs> Uh, I wish you could stay here. Don't go. I'm not going. I'll wait for you till you finish. You're finishing right. at 10. Yeah. No, 9.30. Yeah, so I'll wait we for you. We have to take a photo. Seriously. Definitely, so I'll wait for you. Meda. Meda. Do you sing? I do. Sing for us before we go on to the next break. Oh my God. Me pay gospel be out. Me pay gospel be out. Me pay gospel be out. What do you gospel be out? Me pay Meda. Open Meda, say. Meda da. Meda. Oh, Okay. Um, 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 come, 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 come. I'm not Jewy, you're Betty, and you ray, you're Babon, come away. Now, my car, me da, my heart, my heart.